Hi there everyone and welcome to this, the December edition of Celebrity Signings. Um, I decided to get this one out of the way early and make it a Christmas episode. Um, basically because I'm just not going to get a chance, let's be honest, to do one of these between Christmas and New Year. Um, it's not very likely I'll get any more autographs, but if I do between Christmas and New Year they'll just roll over into the January video, so that's I think is fine. Ignore the croaky voice please if you can hear it um, as well. I have come down with a bit of pre-Christmas lurgy, but hopefully it won't affect the video. So let's crack straight on uh, with the first autograph that I got in December. and It's this one from Cicely Svensson, who is a Norwegian actress. Um, I can't really tell you too much about this one, if I'm totally honest. I watched a film she was in a while ago, quite quite a long while ago, actually, and found she had a website, so I dropped her a line and asked if it was possible to get a signed picture. Um, and she was very, very kind and sent this one to me. It's got a little bit bent, as you can see in the post, but that's the Royal Mail for you. Um, so I got this this picture, and on the back she'd written, Dear Carl, thank you for your lovely words. They mean a lot. Stay awesome. Uh, Cecily Svensson. Um, can't tell you anything more about it, I'm, I'm afraid, other, other than that's what I got. Um, but a nice start, 1st of December, uh, and an autograph from Cecily Svensson. Uh, next up, I think everyone's getting these back at the moment, it was Sean Dooley. Um, Sean's, for me, best known for playing um, Greg in the series Misfits, um, but he was also recently in Doctor Who in the Ghost uh, Machine uh, episode as Epso. Um, so I sent him two pictures, this one, uh, which is him from the Doctor Who episode, and then this one is Greg from Misfits. There weren't really that many good pictures from Misfits, unfortunately, so this is the best of a bad bunch, but I do like the Doctor Who one all the same. Um, took about two and a half weeks to come back, which is pretty good, um, and a really nice addition to the Doctor Who collection, so yeah, very happy with that. Uh, next autographs I got back with my first Panto um, autographs. I've already got this chat before, it's Robin Asquith. Um, perhaps slightly younger viewers might might remember him for things such as um, Coronation Street, which I think he was in a couple of years ago. Um, but he's probably best known for things like the um, uh, Confessions of Films. He was also in Carry On Girls, things like that. Um, I sent him two pictures. This one, which is from Queen Kong, which is like a really sort of campy 70s slash early 80s um, sort of take on the King Kong story with Valerie Leon um, and so I sent him this one and he signed and returned this and then I also sent him this picture from Bless This House as well uh, which is in with Sally Geeson, Sid James and um, I think he was only in maybe one episode of the TV series and then he played the son in the film version of this but uh, again really like this one so um, I sent this off to him and yeah got them back pretty quickly I think it took less than a week uh, for those to come back from him. He's in Panto at the moment, so if you're looking to send to him, um, he is replying, which is great. Uh, next set of autographs I got, um, actually loads of them, which is ridiculous, from the awesome, from the absolutely awesome, lovely uh, Tinica Ann Robson. Pro again, probably not a massively well-known actress, um, but I know her from Spartacus. She played Ophelia in Spartacus. I loved the series um, a few years ago when it, when it came out. It was a great series. Um, but more recently, she's been sort of more involved in her stunt work, and she did some stunt work um, uh, in the film uh, The Justice League, the DC film Justice League. Um, so I managed to find a private address for her, dropped her a line, and she said, yeah, no problems, I'll send you some autographs, or an autograph. Uh, and unfortunately never heard anything from her, so I just dropped her a line again a couple of weeks ago and just said, oh, I uh, haven't received anything just in case you sent it, and it hasn't come through, just thought I'd let you know. And she replied back, she was lovely, saying, oh, I'm really sorry, never, never got around to it, but things really busy. So I had a parcel in the post then, um, a little while later, and I got all of these, which was amazing. She signed this one, Carl, with love, Tinica. She sent me this one as well, uh, which is really cool. She sent me this one for Carl, best wishes and love, Tinica. Uh, she sent me this one again for Carl with Love Tinica. She sent me this one for Carl, Love T, and she signed it. And then she also sent another one which she's written on the back. But cheers, Carl. Thank you for your message and your support in my career. Sorry it took a while to send these. I hope you like them. Wishing you a wonderful Xmas and a marvellous 2019. Take care with Love Tinica. So, in all, one, two, three, four, five, six returns from uh, Tinica and Robson, which is amazing. So, I'm really, really happy with those. <clears throat> uh, next autographs I got uh, are from Tracy Evan, who, again, probably not a lot of people will have heard of, but she's been in so much stuff. I've listed it kind of down here. She was in Doctor Who, Harry Potter, James Bond, Marvel films, Red Dwarf, Star Wars. Um, but she's probably best known for me um, as Carrie Fisher's stunt double in Return of the Jedi. So she, uh, that's actually her in the, in the foreground um, as Carrie Fisher's stunt double in the sort of um, Jabba the Hutt uh, sequences and then Carrie's lying next to her then she signed that Tracy Evan and then I just found this picture which I really liked it's not brilliant quality but I just really liked it um, it's Carrie Fisher and Tracy there I'm guessing 
possibly with another stunt double or whether maybe the director I, I i don't know enough about the star wars stuff to know that um but she signed this one tracy Evans as well and i just really like it because it's just them having just lots of fun on set it's really cool um i sent this one to tracy via equity and it got sent back returned to sender um which was a shame but luckily on the envelope that came back returned to sender was her address um so her actual contact address uh and it came returned to sender because she just never went to pick it up because there was a postage charge on it so i just on the off chance put it back in an envelope and sent it to the address that was on the the rts uh and within less than a week these came back both signed by tracy so really really pleased to get those back from her uh and the last autographs oh actually no tell life I've still got a couple more to go sorry i thought this was the last one it's not uh next autograph i got was um from gareth thomas um, also known as alfie he's a welsh rugby legend obviously being a welshman coming from wales uh had to write to him i've met him in uh, when he was doing panto before um but uh i i had to get a, an autograph from him and so i i, I got this picture signed um, which i absolutely love it's him celebrating i think when wales had beaten england well obviously it was because he's celebrating the england team is behind him uh and he signed it gareth thomas and then put alfie on there as well uh, and as you can see i've met him as well i've this is me with uh, get grabbing a pick with him uh, as he was arriving for for panto um I actually got I got decided to send these in because um, because Daniel of Daniel's autographs um, had actually got a reply from me recently and I suddenly thought I'm a massive Welsh rugby fan this this guy is a Welsh rugby legend why haven't I written to him or why haven't I you know why haven't I sort of got anything signed from him before so uh, so I had to send this and and get it done which I'm really really pleased about. Uh, and the last one then is a, a kind of another another Welsh um, link here and this is Owen Money who maybe a lot of people outside of Wales probably haven't heard of. He's a Welsh comedian. Um, he does a lot of Welsh radio presenting and um, comedy stuff, and he's doing pantomime at the moment around Wales. Um, and so I decided to send a picture to him. I sent it to him, um, and then as I, after I'd sent it, I realised that the pantomime he was doing had actually moved and gone on to another venue, and I thought, well, I'm never going to get this back again. Um, and then about two or three days ago, this reply came back in the post. Uh, so although it's it's kind of been around the houses a little bit he has signed and returned it which is really cool uh and that's it that's everything i've had for for december so um that that's the uh the sort of christmas edition of celebrity signings done and dusted um just really want to finish off by saying i hope everyone has a fantastic christmas uh, and a clown to all of my viewers i really really appreciate it um and i hope you come back in the new year to carry on watching the videos please like and subscribe but please comment because i love to hear comments read comments from people who are watching the videos kind of makes it realize that it's worthwhile doing that people are actually watching and enjoying them uh, any questions or any comments or anything else put them below but as i say failing that beyond that have a fantastic christmas and a dollar to all of you out there and i will speak to you again very very soon bye